The Prince of Providence. It is a book based on former Mayor Vincent Buddy Sancy's rise to political prominence and his subsequent fall from grace. Now, a movie's set to begin production in August, and tonight we've got a peek at which actor will play Buddy and what the real life Buddy thinks about the movie. New at 6, Eyewitness News reporter Joan Moran joins us live outside the newsroom of the Providence Journal. She has the details. Steve, we can tell you the cast has a couple of heavy hitters. Ed Burns, we're told, already in. In negotiations right now, Robin Williams, the one and only. Now, we did get a chance to speak by phone to director producer Michael Correnti. He didn't want to say much because he tells me the big announcement is here in Providence tomorrow. But he did say there could be 10 movies about Buddy. And he said that because tonight, the man behind the tale has his own take on Correnti's movie which he tells me will not tell the truth and the movie that will. I have no, no part of that. That's a mercenary uh, effort on his part to try to make a few bucks. It will be about his life, but don't expect Buddy Cianci to make a cameo or even be a consultant in the making of The Prince of Providence. Director and producer Michael Correnti's long-awaited movie has the former Providence mayor speaking out. I don't know how a Correnti film could tell the whole story. They don't know the, the intimacies I've shared with people. They don't know the uh, full facts. The Prince of Providence, based on the best-selling book by Providence Journal reporter Mike Stanton, is expected to start filming in August in Rhode Island. The cast includes Ed Burns, Adam Goldberg, Dermot Mulroney, little-known Oliver Platt from The Three Musketeers, expected to play Buddy, and Robin Williams in negotiations. How about two movies about the former mayor? Buddy tells us first about a Tribeca Films movie that will depict his life, his politics, and his falls along the way. Robert De Niro's company purchasing the rights to his story, and he is happy about it. It would be truthful. It would be, after all, who, would, who knows a life story of someone better than the person whose life you're talking about, as opposed to a reporter who gets transplanted here from someplace else. Not too happy about that Correnti movie. Now, Buddy tells me his lawyers will be keeping a close eye on the Correnti movie. We should tell you that De Niro's company is expected to make their announcement about their Buddy movie tomorrow, maybe even the same time that Correnti is expected in Kennedy Plaza making announcements about his plans. Now, I asked Buddy what he would play if he did star in De Niro's movie, and he told me he'd like to play Judge Torres, and then laughed. He said if he played the judge, he certainly changed a lot of things. We're live tonight in Providence with the Mobile Newsroom. I'm Joan Moran, Eyewitness News.